Good morning, everyone. Happy Sunday fun day. What's going on? How's your weekend going? Show you where we are today. All right, so I was here, uh, I don't know, a couple weeks ago. And this is the Shinnecock Locks. Connecting Peconic Bay over here and heading out to the Shinnecock Inlet. So, I don't know if any of you guys are familiar with the way locks work. You got two different water levels when the, when the tides change. So, uh, what happens is the boats pull in through here and then they close the doors, they suck the water out, and the boats go out on the other side, like a step. So, let me show you the other side, it's kind of cool. It's definitely kind of cool. All right, so I'll walk you up over here, you'll see what I'm talking about. So because of the different water levels, if they just leave the gates open, it gets very turbulent. It's like rapids almost. It's not safe to get through, so they have these locks here. Let's show you. So you see the floodgates here almost. So right now the water levels, I don't know if you could see, get in there. It's only about eh, two foot difference, I would say. pretty cool so the boats are all in the section over there and the gates are closed at that side once all the boats go in the gates close at that side actually they close now and they'll suck the water in this case they're gonna raise the water up actually if you're watching over there the boats are actually getting higher but the blue canvas is now we can see it they're slowly rising up Train going by on the bridge over there. Pretty cool stuff. So I don't know if you can see the boats getting higher. And as soon as they get up to the same level, they'll open the gate over there. Boats will be on their way. They'll get out fishing. Most likely this time in the morning. <clears throat> so I always thought that was pretty cool. We could take some parallels for life like that. You gotta take your time, take your steps, go slow, let the water rise around you till you take it to the next level. But um, that's not the message of today. So today is day number 69 of uh, 365. So I think the message of today should be friends with benefits. All right, so that's a perfect Sunday morning, uh, perfect Sunday morning topic. But everyone knows the, uh, the, the traditional meaning of friends with benefits. And uh, that's uh, obviously where I guess you share your body with your friend and uh, fulfill, fulfill each other's needs. But uh, I'm talking about, are you a friend with benefits in faith? In faith, do you share, do you share what uh, God puts in you um, and your, uh, whatchamacallit? Um, do you share your faith with your friends and when they don't have faith, when they need faith, when they're going through struggles, do you reach out to your friends? Do you uh, are you a positive force? Um, yes, yeah, spooning counts, Benny. Um, so, um, what benefits are you offering your friends? What benefits are you offering your friends? I'm not talking sexual right now. Uh, that's a whole different topic. But I figured I'd get your attention on day 69. Um, what, what are you offering your friends? What are you offering your friends? Um, do you reach out to your friends and make sure they're okay? Do you say prayers for your friends? you stick your hand out and pull them up um again we talk a lot about apex i know it's like a cult but oh hold on there's the boats leaving pulling out of the locks the water rose all right so <clears throat> friends with benefits are you giving your friends benefits um mentally uh faith business uh friendship do you, um, do you go out of your way to reach out to someone each day? Think about it. Is there people in your life that, you know, 
maybe feeling a little down, maybe they're sick, maybe they're going through uh, relationship issues, maybe they're going through divorce, um, maybe they've lost their job, maybe they've lost their way. Um, a lot of people out there uh, struggling. And do you offer benefits? Do you reach out and help them? Do you reach out and say hello? Do you reach out and offer them guidance? Um, think about it, think about it. Friends with benefits, friends with benefits. So uh, what benefits do you offer your friends? And again, get your minds out of the gutter. Just because it's day 69 doesn't mean you got to get your mind in the gutter. Um, but I just want to get your attention with that. <clears throat> think about it, think about it. Go out of your day, go out of your way today. Reach out to one of your friends that you haven't heard from in a while. And uh, make sure they're all right. Make sure they're all right. Offer them some encouragement. Um, it's really nice when someone says, hey, you okay? Everything good in your life? You need anything? Can I help you in any way? Um, it means a lot to uh, a lot of people. It means a lot to me when someone checks in on me. Hey, how you been? You okay? Everything good? Um, simple, simple couple words can really change someone's outlook for the day. Um, people ask me, why am I doing this? Why am I doing this? You know what? 365 days, I'm going to do this in a row. I don't know if I'm going to stop after 365, but that's the goal. And I figure if I could touch one person a day, hopefully give them some inspiration, uh, get them... Um, <laughs> Penny, stop with your uh, hijacking my post. Um, <laughs> For those of you who aren't watching in the comments, Benny's putting his phone number out there because it's got a 69 in it. Get your mind out of the gutter, Benny. Um, but if I can help one person a day for 365 days, um, get a better outlook on life, um, <clears throat> get their health in order, get their mind in order, get their business in order, I'm making a difference in the world, and that makes me happy. It's, uh, it's fun to help people. Uh, Bible verse this morning, paraphrasing, uh, it was kind of like make your father proud, um, earthly father, uh, godly father. And, uh, you know, are you living your life where you make your father proud? Are you spreading God's word? Um, yeah, now, now Benny totally hijacked my post with the 69 phone number. All right, Dawn. <laughs> you guys all have your mind in the gutter. But um, anyway, so that's the message of the day. We've taken it from the gutter and we've made it positive. Be the friend with benefits. Benefit your friends in your life. Um, feed your brain. Feed their brain. Feed your faith. Feed their faith. Be faithful for them. Say a prayer for them. And uh, make the world a better place. Make your father proud. Both earthly father. Both earthly father and heavenly father. All right. So let's jump in prayers. Um, Sunday. So we... Sunday, fun day. We got to say a couple prayers here. So... Uh, Let's get that rolling. Uh, in the name of the Father, Son, Holy Spirit, Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Dear God, on this Sunday, please uh, help us all do better in life. Um, be a friend with benefits to our friends, to help them along the journey, to um, think of others before ourselves, and, and reach a hand out, and pull other people up. Help us to get out of our own heads and uh, think about the big picture think about the world realize that we're all in this together and we all need to work together um, to make the world a better place to make everyone happy um, it's hard going alone it's hard doing this, this alone when you bring good people into your life that support you that encourage you that hold you accountable it makes life easier so we thank you God for all that you give us uh, we're grateful um, we're grateful for sunrises yeah, the sun's popping out we are grateful for the rain. We are grateful for our families, our friends. We're grateful for opportunities that arise in our lives. So we thank you, God, for all you do for us every day. All right, all right. Hope oh, we dropped the hat. So it's Sunday morning. FYE, force of average was tough this morning. Getting out of bed was really, uh, really 
definitely not easy. Uh, it was raining pretty hard this morning and I didn't want to get out, but we do it every day. We get up, we ride again. We ride at dawn, no matter what's going on in your life, get up and ride every day, make it a positive day. All right, so Sunday fun day, get out there, be a friend with benefits, get your mind out of the gutter. Love you all, God bless, and we will see you in the morning.